I'm gonna get this out really quick. Well, that's wrong. And uh, we can change this. Um, very simple. One simple step you need to do. See this Y? Uh, change it to an X. And there you have it. Solutions to a quadratic. Just this part alone, the solutions to that, is going to give you the solutions to where um, quadratics roots cross the x-axis. Not necessarily the y-axis. This and this. And this is the x-axis. doesn't cross y. Um, these are called roots, if you want trivia. So here, uh, number seven. Uh, it's uh, not really a quad well, yeah, it is a quadratic, and uh, it's the equation of a circle in a linear system, and they're like, oh my god, find the points in which they intersect. Okay, that's cool, I really want to do that. Anyways, they give you this. Could graph it, don't feel like graphing it, so uh, let's just substitute squared plus uh, x minus 3 squared equals 9, x squared plus x squared minus 6x plus 9 uh, equals 9, uh, 2x squared minus 6x equals 0, uh, bring it over here, change color, x squared minus 3x equals 0, um, x out, x minus 3 equals 0, x equals 0, x minus 3 equals 0, x could be 0, or x could be 3, substitute back in the equation, x is 0, y is 0, or, uh, wait, x is 0, y is negative 3, if you sub 0, your y is negative 3. If you sub 3, y is 0. At least I think it's right. Um, I really can't care less enough to check that it's true. It probably is true. Um, yeah, it is true. So your coordinates are either going to be... Um, 0, negative 3. Or... 3 and 0. Here it's a bit more tricky to try and do a substitution. Still don't want to graph this, so um, I mean I guess we should manipulate this. Uh, so how about we make it x equals y plus 4 equal instead and uh, we can do a y squared plus 8x plus 16 equals y squared plus 4x plus 4 equals 4 instead. So, 2y squared, wait a second, what am I even doing? This is 8y, this is 4y. Uh, 12y plus 20 equals 4. 2y, y squared plus 6y plus 10 equals 2. Minus 10, so it's negative 8. Uh, y squared plus 6y plus 8 equals 0. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. So it's x plus 2, x plus 4. x is negative 2, or an x is negative 4. I'm just like solving this algebraically for you. Hold on. Okay, so we have x equals negative 2, and x equals negative 4 was our original equation that we could plug crap in y equals x minus 4 okay so y equals negative 2 minus 4 y is negative 6 so y equals negative 6 or y could be um, negative 4 minus 4 y is negative 8 don't even want to check it but it would probably be correct, and if it isn't, shame on you. Shame on me, rather. So our solutions are negative 2, negative 6, or negative 4, negative 8. I'm sure.
that the answers given are splendid. And uh, both these points are secant because there's two solutions. Just saying. Bye.